Today we're at the Civic Center for Foodie Friday, an event that's going on every Friday until the end of August. It is Kids Art Days going on. We will be battling kids, we'll be battling rain, and we're going to be battling some food. Let's stuff our faces, Prince George. Chef, Chef Ryan? Yeah, you recommended a pizza dog earlier? That wasn't. It was fantastic. Awesome. I was so blown away. It's very unique. It's real good. Yeah, we try to do something new each, each week with Foodie Friday. We do our regular menu with chicken fingers, fish and chips and whatnot. But always trying to do something different. What do you, uh, where do, can people find you? You have a business during the week, right? Yeah, I own the Wakers. The Wakers Bistro. Sure. And we actually have a new restaurant called Zed opening up another new house. It's like amazing. You guys don't even believe this, man. It's like a pizza with like a hot dog. It's like two of my favorite things in one. How could you go wrong? Next, I stopped over at Spicy Greens for a taste of South Asia. I got um, a veggie roll, a samosa, I think. I don't know what kind of bread this is. And then it's just butter chicken and rice. I love butter chicken. It's my favorite Indian dish. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's really good. really good. After the butter chicken, I moseyed on over to the smokehouse for some fish and chips. Hey, to the smokehouse here at Foodie Friday. He was right. Fish and chips is the way to go. So the Friendship Center opens Monday to Friday. Monday to Friday. And uh, from 8 o'clock to 4 30. And uh, we have uh, our store and the prices are rarely fair. Yeah, it's actually pretty cheap there. And I started there as a student. And we have a program that runs four months. And it's not like to get the actual, to be certified as a chef, but uh, you get the experience to be in a, in a restaurant. And that's how I started. And now I'm taking the lead. And they, they, give you, they give you a job, so you're working full time? Yeah. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, 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 into my mouth! Mmm, Dory tastes good. I found her. Pineapple turmeric. What is the name of the company? It's a um, company called Cold Juicery. Cold Juicery. And it's located yeah. here in Prince George? Yeah. Um, I don't own it, but I am right here. And it's up at the Sports Center at the University. And then we also sell our juices at Playgrounds Cafe near c And then we do all the events. Yeah. That's a pineapple turmeric. So it's pineapple turmeric, lemon, and carrot. It's quite a unique taste. All of our juices are cold pressed and we don't use any added sugar. We just um, juice everything fresh. It's very sweet. That's yeah. surprising. Yeah, from the pineapple, yeah. Everywhere, what kind of meat is that? Just, just don't air meat. I don't even know what the hell that is. Meat? It's a uh, ground beef, uh, seasoned ground beef essentially. It's got uh, some red crumbs and uh, it's a meat loaf essentially. It's shaved really thinly. Uh, yeah, it's a uh, slowly, it's a slow rotisserie, vertical rotisserie. So yeah, it's got that uh, delicious flavor when it cooks in its own fat. You can't really mimic that flavor. God damn. So good. <laughs> yeah, we're here. We're gonna finish our five course meal with some ice cream. Sound crew and film crew, let's eat some ice cream. It's so good. I Oh man, 
what a great day it turned out to be. Thank you, Foodie Friday. Oh, Foodie Friday, why have you forsaken me? Oh. There's gonna be a Foodie Friday at the Civic Center every Friday until the end of August. I rarely recommend it. Also, check out Summerfest when that rolls around. I hear it's the 15th of July. And don't overeat at Foodie Fridays. I'm Garrett Perry, and I'm doing Prince George.